friends, and this is another YouTube video, and this weekly's Bible verse is um, Psalms chapter 37, verse 4, so if you want to turn to the Bible and pause the video and find this Bible verse, which is Psalms chapter 37, verse 4, and, um, and if you want to just hear me, um, you know, like, read it to you and explain it to you. That's what I'm here for, but if you want to choose that method, you can. <clears throat> but, um, I'm going to start reading right now. Delight thyself also in the Lord, and he shall give thee the desires of thine heart. Psalms chapter 37, verse 4. What I think this Bible verse means to me, like, um, God gave me, you know, like, some of the words, you know, like, to describe the Bible verse. So... It's both of our ideas, you know, but, um, you know, um, what I think this Bible verse means to me is, like, if we, like, delight means, like, make somebody happy, like, delight means happy-ish, like, happy, um, so, if we please the Lord and we make him happy and... If we worship him and if we have faith, trust, and hope in him, God will give us the the desires that he wants us to have. Like, if he wants us to uh, go buy a home, you know, then, you know, it'd be in his will, but he'll give you the desire to do whatever he wants you to do. So, you know... Just say, like, if he called you to preach, and you need to say yes, or if you don't, you might not get a second chance, and so, yeah. Um, but, I think that's what it means to me, like, like, he will give you the desires that what you want to do and what he wants you to do as well. You know, like I said, like, so you need to obey him, you need to trust, have hope, faith, and worship the Lord Jesus Christ. Um, and, you know, he will do everything in his will for us. You know, he died on the cross for me and my sins and for everybody and for everybody's sins. And, you know, and if he, like, tells you that you need to get saved, you need to get saved. Um, but, um, you can't get saved twice. Like, say that if you feel like you need to get saved again, um, then that can't happen. But, um, if, like, you just say that you wanted to get saved, but... God didn't tell you to get saved, then you're not saved. You gotta wait until God calls on you um, to uh, get saved. Because, like me, like <clears throat> I'm not trying to brag anything, but um, like I'm not a bragger like that about you know my faith or anything like that. But um, you know I'm just telling you like how like he did, like, with me, like, he told me in a small voice, um, you know, to get saved, he told me that twice, like, get saved, get saved, and then the voice went away, then I was like, what, you know, like, I was kind of confused, then I told my mom, then I told my preacher, then, you know, he told me, you know, like, if I needed to do it if that's how I felt about it and and if that's what you know God wants me to do then I should do it then when the you know but that was on the uh, church bus and um, then you know I uh, <clears throat> went inside church then church started then the singing started I'm pretty sure then 
uh, after the singing, like they asked if anybody had anything to say or anything, then I said, I feel like I need to get saved, then boom. Like right then, immediately, the preacher got around me and asked me a few questions and told me, like, some of the right answers, you know, like, that, you know, but, um, you know, he was just telling me, you know, what God did and does, you know, for us all and, um, and what he did for us. Then he asked, do you got anything to say? And I said, I'm saved. And everybody started clapping. Then I just started bawling and crying. It was the best it was just the best um, experience, and it was the best day, well, the best night, actually, of my life. Um, but it was actually the best day, and the day after, because I was excited. I told my friends, I was like, hey, I got saved, and it was exciting. I wish I could um, go back to 2011, when I was nine years old. In the revival, that'd be so cool if they build a time machine. That'd be so cool. But um, we can always have that memory. We just gotta ask God to give us that memory. You know, like to let us always think about that memory. And if the devil ever tries to get you down, like he's done me, you know, he does everything to try to make us not do what God wants us to do. God will, you know, tell you, you know. You're saved, you know, why worry? Because if you know you're saved, then why worry about it, you know? Because, you know, you're not supposed to worry after you get saved. But, you know, the devil will try to get you down, but God will always pick you back up. I'm going to have to end it here, guys. Please like, subscribe, or comment below. And <clears throat> eat some Oreos. And don't forget, Jesus saves and God bless.